Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 17 player review on my channel. And in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 88 rated SBC Al Sharari. So if you do want to go and complete this SBC, it is only available until Wednesday, so you better do it very quick if you do want this card. And it will set you back around 100,000 coins. And in my opinion, looking at his stats, for 100,000 coins, you are getting a lot of, you know, value for the price you are putting into this card. So now getting some of his in-game stats, as you can see he has 96 curve, 92 dribbling, 88 finishing, those are some of his standout stats. As well as this of course is the 5 star skill moves, 4 star weak foot, what is very good in-game. And his traits he does have is the injury prone and finesse shot. And getting into his con now, his first con is injury prone, um, just as his traits said. Now this is probably the most annoying thing about this card. Every other match he seems to get injured what's really annoying and as you know this year FIFA on FIFA um, injury cards are very expensive so this can set you back a lot of coins so that's one thing to sort of watch out for before you get this card you're gonna have to realize that you're gonna have to spend quite a few thousand coins on healing cards just because how frequently he seems to get injured but now getting into his first pro what is his shooting you know from his finishing to long shots his shooting is honestly incredible and as I said in the 86 rated inform Al Sharari review, I didn't really think that there would be a big difference between his 86 and the 88 rated card. And the big difference I could tell between the two cards is the shooting ability. This card has a much better finishing than the 86 rated card. And as well as this, it also has a very good long shots. So now getting into his next pro, what is his dribbling? This guy's dribbling is probably on par with players such as, you know, Messi and Ronaldo. It's literally that good. Um, one of the best dribblers on the game. Really good for scaling with. And as I say, with every five-star skiller, um, you know, five-star skill moves and high dribbling stats, they just seem to go hand in hand. And then the final pro I could find with this card was his pace. And as you see from a lot of these clips here, he's just absolutely rapid. He runs plus players um, like, you know, Bellerin, Carl Walker. He is literally that fast, even though he only has 80, sprint speed and um, in game I think he like his acceleration is in the 90s so yeah that's one thing to look out for with this card and then the final um, con I could find with this card was his strength he seems to be very weak and this sort of you know he, every time he's in a shoulder to shoulder battle even though I think he has 17-9 physical he just seems to get out strength for some reason so it, that's something you know sort of have to look out for now getting into his work rate some people may think that you know high medium work rates aren't the best for a winger but in my opinion I actually found him all right to be honest um you know his normal card is a winger this card's a cam um so it seems to be all right you know high medium work rates so guys this is going to be the video if you have enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel I hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching and see you next time